New right now on News 12, these online videos, they show drivers performing reckless stunts in front of crowds of people, and Suffolk police say they're cracking down on them. News 12's Kevin BC live in North Lindenhurst. And uh, Kevin, uh, that was the scene of uh, one of those events, right, being broken up? Yeah, that's right, Doug. So according to Suffolk police, there was a large and rather raucous crowd in this parking lot at around 1.30 Sunday morning. And this is where they say they arrested a man who was doing donuts in front of a big crowd of people. And apparently this area is such a hot spot for this kind of activity. Take a look at this. You can see tire marks in the pavement. They come within inches of the crowd. Drivers performing high-speed donuts where one false move could kill or injure dozens of spectators. Police call it an illegal car meetup. Participants call it a takeover because so many people show up, they can shut down streets and even overrun Suffolk patrol cars. In this video, one person could be seen stomping on the roof of a cop car with its lights flashing. Someone's going to get killed. Naeem Kuchuk lives across the street from this King Cullen parking lot in North Lindenhurst, where police arrested a 27-year-old man early Sunday morning for performing donuts in front of a crowd. This Instagram video from August of 2020 shows one of those takeover events in that parking lot. Kuchuk says it's a constant and dangerous disturbance. I saw like a bunch of car and it was like a teenager kids. They spin around like in you know, a smoking. They chasing each other. They spin around to my neighbor too, my street too. Actually, had like you know, banging. My daughter's scared. Police arrested a 24-year-old at the Deer Park train station parking lot also for performing donuts in front of spectators. In this case, the aviation section and MTA police were also involved. I do see it. I see the kids out there, you know, racing, doing donuts. So the people who were arrested are now being charged with reckless endangerment and reckless driving. Their vehicles were impounded and dug. Uh, Suffolk police want everyone out there to know that if they're caught doing something like that, their cars could be impounded too. Wow. So Kevin, police are saying they're cracking down. What are the plans to do so? So basically that means that they're partnering with other law enforcement agencies. They're also throwing additional resources at this. You heard that the aviation unit was called out for that incident at the Deer Park train station. Also, they're saying that they are aggressively targeting areas where this type of activity is known to happen, including this parking lot where I am right now.